In first tutorial on portfolio theory, we learned how to find unique solution to Markowitz portfolio optimization problem given portfolio's expected return. If we were to plot a feasible set of portfolios in mean variance space, it would look as follows. This curve that represents portfolios with different levels of expected return and volatility is called the mean variance boundary. And the area inside this boundary is called the feasible set. The point on this mean variance boundary that has the minimum volatility represents the minimum variance portfolio. The part of this mean variance boundary that lies above the minimum variance portfolio is called the efficient frontier. Any point on the efficient frontier represents a portfolio that has higher expected return for a given level of risk than any other portfolio inside the feasible set. Now question is, how do we solve for this minimum variance portfolio? To answer this question, let's set up the optimization problem. We learned in first tutorial that Markowitz was trying to minimize a portfolio's variance. So for a portfolio with K assets, WM and WN represent the weights of Mth and Nth assets in the portfolio, and CMN represents the covariance between assets M and N. Summing over this, where M and N go from 1 all the way to K, this represents the variance of the portfolio. And Markowitz was trying to minimize this variance. We're going to multiply by a half again because it'll make the calculations much easier later on and minimizing a particular function or half of the function is equivalent. So we will minimize this variance subject to the constraint that sum of weights of all assets in the portfolio must equal 1. Notice how we don't specify any particular return target here and that's because we're trying to find a minimum variance portfolio and not the one that needs a particular return target. So let's set up a Lagrangian to solve this optimization problem. So our Lagrangian is as follows. L equals, we'll first write the objective function. Minus lambda times the first constraint, which is the sum of weights of all assets in the portfolio must equal 1. In order to solve for weights that would give us the minimum variance portfolio, we'll take the derivative of this with respect to weight of every single asset as well as the parameter lambda. So taking the derivative of this with respect to the weight of first asset in the portfolio, W1, we get covariance of first asset with all of the n assets in the portfolio times the weight of nth asset and we'll sum over this where n goes from 1 all the way to k minus lambda. Similarly, we'll take the derivative of this with respect to weight of second, third, all the way to kth asset. So taking the derivative with respect to weight of kth asset, we get the covariance of kth asset with all other n assets in the portfolio times the weight of n asset. And summing over this, where n again goes from 1 all the way to k minus lambda. And finally, we'll take the derivative with respect to the parameter lambda. And we get negative the sum of weight of all n assets where n goes from 1 all the way to k minus 1. Now, in order to solve for weights that would give us the minimum variance portfolio, we'll set all these equations equal to 0. So now we can use these equations to solve for weights that would get us the minimum variance portfolio. Let's represent these equations in a matrix system to solve for weights. So the matrix representation of these equations is as follows. So we have simply taken these set of equations and put them in a matrix form. Let's call this matrix A. And C here represents the variance covariance matrix of K assets. Now if A is invertible, if A is invertible, 
then the solution to the system is as follows. The column vector that represents the weights W1 all the way to WK as well as the parameter lambda equals A inverse times the column vector of zeros and 1. So this is the unique solution to our optimization problem and gives us the minimum variance portfolio. If there are any questions or comments, please feel free to post. Thank you.